back in a bit, but all right, let's have a look. Oh shit! Patient four four zero. Client is a high-profile individual who has been exhibiting excessive and destructive guilt following a recent professional incident. Friends and colleagues introduced her to the Neurostagia Institute, concerned that there may be a deeper issue at play than the client realizes. Hmm. And none of the other patients have been uh, marked down for a walkthrough, so I'm going to be absolutely fucked. I'm going to be absolutely buggered then. Unless there's like a walkthrough on YouTube or something showing uh, the solutions, then I think that's the only way. But I mean, last time I tried loading... Uh, anything uh, in this stream it just in one of the str in the last uh, last stream it just uh, went tits up oh, no it wasn't Friday it was Wednesday wasn't it Friday was uh, lost in blue which I have finished the raft for which means tomorrow we will be sailing across that bit of the volcanic thing and uh, into the next area I appreciate the concern and all your efforts. But all this is quite excessive. Let's be candid here. I have Alzheimer's. Mistakes are to be expected. This thing that happened at the performance, not mm. knowing where I was, it was mortifying. Yes, I'm embarrassed, ashamed even. But I suppose that's just my new reality now. My most prestigious Jesus. days are behind me. What happened there is just the new normal. Swallowing a mistake like that. Ever since I was a child, my motto was always, pain makes you worthy. Perfection makes it worth it. So yes, I feel guilt. Who wouldn't? Especially someone in my position but to call it excessive, erratic. <laughs> Obsessive. Look, my friends and colleagues, they mean well, but they simply don't understand. They never have. Mm -hmm. I built my whole life in pursuit of perfection. Once you've experienced true perfection, nothing less will ever do. That performance. I failed the audience. I failed the orchestra. I failed myself. I failed everyone who has depended on me because I made a terrible mistake. The first, no doubt, of many to come. And there is not a goddamn thing you, me, or any of your technologies or techniques can do about it. Mm. I can work through my problems on my own. I always have. Furthermore, to be frank, the suggestion that trauma has anything to do with this is a tremendous overreaction. Just stop wasting your time on me. At this point, why does any of it matter anyway? Because you're clearly disturbed and people care about you. Hmm. A brain. The flowers growing out of it. Blue, white, and red door. Let's try blue. Nothing. Ah. The white one will work though. A concert for the ages, for all ages. Go on hands of the piano, the perfect child conservatory. See a living legend with the whole family. Hmm.
golden hand to the piano. Hmm. Well, something tells me I shouldn't go. Oh, we can't go through that way. Where am I trying to act normal? Wait. Wait, you'll remember. What am I doing here? No idea. Oh, bloody hell. Don't see any obvious uh, images before I move on. Oh. Oh. There's an image. This. The Alzheimer's may remember what I'd forgotten. Oh, that's not good. That does not sound good at all. Making you remember something that you'd forgotten. Especially if it's something hideously traumatic. I know my bloody grand went through fucking Alzheimer's and it's not a, not a bloody thing you want anyone to go through. I didn't really, to be honest, I never really liked my gran, but I wouldn't want to have wished that on her, to be honest. Fast enough, this stupid bloody lag. Ooh. Where is that, buddy? Ah! Blue one. Ah! Go. My parents hired a famous piano teacher, nothing but the best. Mm. That's not a good thing. Well, pressuring anyone like that is not. Oh, we're in the brain. Okay, two. Hmm. Hmm? Hmm? The 
hell? Your mistakes cause everyone's pain. Fucking hell. As someone who is far too um, harsh on his own uh, mistakes, I can sympathise with that. Although I'm not certainly no special pianist or anything like that, I've always uh, had that kind of strain, you know. Um, I want to do more for my parents, but currently I just can't, and it's just tearing me. Tell me apart, to be honest. Um, he taught me to always fear failure. Cello? Oh shit! Alright, so it's definitely the bottom first. Middle, top, there we go. You must go to all lengths. One, longest, two, second, third, shortest. Okay. Uh Ooh. Yeah, it's not the top one. Let's try let's try going from the bottom like earlier. No, the bottom one doesn't work. Right. Oh shit. Oh it's a little dot there. Here we go. Sake. <laughs> I won. One. Oh, for fuck's sake. I've done them all. For God's sake. Oh, Jesus Christ. Your hands are useless if you don't know how to use them. Third finger, first finger, thumb and finger? I've got no idea. Hmm, what does this say? Order leads to greatness. Four be the three, three be the two, two be the one, one be the five, three be the five, two bigger than four. 
I, I've got no pissing clue. Just gonna have to go by, uh... Three, four, two, five. I don't know how I could have gotten that from that, but never mind. Got six. Stages of perfection: hope, exhaustion, anger, despair, sacrifice, joy. Jesus. What the hell? Um. Hope? Ah! Nope, that's the wrong. Going super sane over here. Of course not. No, of course. Sacrifice, which must be these. And then, joy. There we go. That gave me a bit of a better idea, actually. Okay, now, look at that thing. Okay, what's the hint here, then? Uh, fingers, feet, heal, he failure doesn't. Short, long, long, short, really long, short, long. Let's see what the fuck this means. Um, okay. Definitely a long one, so I'm thinking of it. For God's sake, it wasn't that long, surely. One. Ugh, I think another one short one, wasn't it? Sake. 
No. I'm just making sure I'm not. Yeah. I'm sure someone out there is going to point out what my bloody problem is. Mm. Oh. Oh shit. not So it's not too... And the final one. Jesus Christ. That bloody thing didn't fly all over the screen. Hmm. The heck? Great to inform you that tonight's performance has been cancelled. The Golden Hands of Piano is no longer good enough to play here. She has offered our audience, offended our audience, she has wounded our orchestra, she has embarrassed herself, she can try to redeem herself, but we all know what a failure she is now. 
Where there isn't perfection, there needs to be pain. Good lord, that sound, sounds really, really unhealthy sort of thing to say. Music monthly. Are the golden hands tarnished? She forgot where she was. When the famous pianist seemed lost during highly anticipated solo. Guess who told us if fingers can't be used properly, then they may as well be broken. That was why a bloody instructor must have said, wasn't it? Child disappoints family and supporters. Wake up and hear the music as the golden hands began to lost a touch. I forgot that not everyone is a perfectionist. There we go, it's disappeared. Probably programmed to save the item deletes itself, I'm guessing. What the hell? Um... F... C... D... A fucking hell. E G F Nope. Of course not. Someone tells me that was not correct. I just want to go back in there and finish it. No, no, okay. I'm not going to go back in there and finish it. I'm going to go back there. No. Got a pen here, see so if that happens again, I'll bloody write it down. Why are these flowers inside her brain? I mean, the brain back there, not just the. You know, in oh, what the fuck was that? I was never truly gifted at anything like all the other kids. Everyone has their gifts. Look at what she makes everyone proud. A student and teacher enjoy fruits of hard work. Pain makes you worthy. Perfection it makes it worth it. Jesus. What an awful thing to put on a child. A lot of my own, I believe, is internalised. Oh, what the fuck was that? Once I made a painful mistake. My hands were taught a lesson. Ooh. Ouch! the hell? Bleeding and we're heading towards the ceiling. Oh, look at the 
this place. Blood everywhere. Fingers fucking broken. Because I think I know what happened to her now. Asshole was slamming the uh, the thing down on her fingers whenever she fucked up. It. Oh shit! Ugh. Teeth there won't let me through, so I'm guessing there's something I need to do here. Hmm. Kind of beautiful in a gory way. You know, the way those fingers keep falling off. Constant perfection allowed me to become a celebrated pianist. Way is probably open now. Actually, let's go back this way. Oh no, I can't seem to find my way. There we go. There we go. Jesus Christ! What's a broken of fingers? Can you imagine? Oh! You imagine that as a child, just having your Fingers smashed to pieces like that. Fucking hell. Am I really meant to go back through there? Is it going to be anything new this time? Oh no, it's brought me back to here. Fucking hell. Something killed me here. Hmm. Oh, whatever it was, it didn't happen again. Lovely blood. Hmm, this has stopped me again, so I'm guessing I've gone straight past another image. Hmm. Oh shit. Um, hmm. Ah, there we go. My parents didn't seem to care. Fucking hell. I think I'd lose my shit if I had a daughter learn the piano and then the pianist fucking smashed her fingers with the uh, bloody thing as a punishment for uh, messing up messing up the keys. Jesus. I'm sure most people would lose their bloody shit over that. Not as the pianist, but as the parent. It could be you. Oh uh, yes. Through the store. Hmm? Two is still left. You stupid brain. It's blocked. The other children tease me because of my hands. Freaking hell. Oh, 
I can barely see. Ah. The hell? I don't know what that means. Oh, hello there, Mohit, and thanks for the look. <laughs> oh, stupid thing, go on. Oh, they're turning black. Turning from red to black. There we go. Thank you, thank you. Flowers everywhere. Hmm. hmm. Yeah, thank you for the uh, look, uh, Barrow Heat 23. <laughs> I like your emote there. Arr. Very piratey. What's this? He had very high expectations of me. Hmm. Alright, let's get back to the back to the main brain and try and figure this out. You are more than your pain. You are better than perfection. Than your pain and better than perfection. That sounds a bit bloody creepy to me. Right, let me think. Um, what was the first one? The Alzheimer's may remember what I'd forgotten. Would that be the worst one? Uh, Uh, parents hired a family, I think of the best. Taught me always fear failure. I forget that not everyone is a perfectionist. Uh, I forget that everyone is not a perfectionist. Uh, so I was never truly gifted or anything like that, like the other kids. Let's try that. Once I made a painful mistake in my hands, I taught a lesson. Constant perfection alone to become a sub pianist. Parents didn't seem to care. Oh wait, no no no, it should be um my parents hired da 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 He had uh where is it? He had very high expectations of me. Oh shit, missed. Which has some sort of hint system to point at one of you. Had very high expectations of me. Uh, I forget that not everyone's a perfectionist. No. Uh, 
Um, once I made a painful mistake, my hands were taught a lesson. Person seemed to care. Shit. Nope, that's wrong. Shit. But there's no like hint as to say what's wrong or not. Was it the wrong order? Was it? Were they all wrong? Um. Start off with a uh, famous piano teacher, constant perfection, love me to know. Uh, you taught me to always fear failure. Once I made a painful mistake, you taught me a lesson. The other children teasing because of my hands. Uh, my parents didn't seem to care. Oh, fuck it out. <sighs> See this in the uh, parents, I remember something I'd forgotten. Famous piano teacher. Yeah, not perfectionist. I was never truly gifted at anything like all the other kids. No, no. Uh, mm. I forget that everyone's not perfectionist. No, no, no. Um, Taught me always fear this painful mistake which fucked up the hands and taught me a lesson. Uh, parents didn't seem to care, other children teased me with my hands. He had really high expectations for me. I was not truly gifted. I forget not everyone is a perfectionist. Um, parents didn't seem to care. Uh, 
Then what's what's the bloody correct answer then? Outside of famous, but no. Fear, fear. I see no obvious. <sighs> what could it be? What could it be? Uh, you remember something I'd forgotten? Best. He had high expectations for me. Told me to always fear failure. My hands were taught to listen. Oh, for fuck's sake! There's no suggestion as to what I got wrong there. What the hell? Oh, okay, maybe that's what. <laughs> now the game's realizing something. Okay, um. Okay, that isn't the first one then, the whole... Uh, I was never truly really gifted or anything like the other kids. Nothing but the best. Oh wait. Yeah, very high expectations for me. Taught me to fear failure. And then he fucked up my hands. Oh shit. We're gonna get there eventually. I'm not leaving till we get this one done. Oh, piss off. Hmm. Uh, maybe it's he taught me to fear failure. Painful mistake, my hands were taught a lesson. Um, parents didn't care, or. Parents didn't care? Of course not. Hmm. 
It's made fun of me because of my hands. Fucking hell. Okay, help me out then. Can destroy, destroy one of the things. Ugh. Um, constant perfection allow me to become. A celebrated pianist. Uh, I've forgotten that everyone is a perfectionist. I have a famous teacher. Expectations of me? Oh, for God's sake. Well, now it's not getting rid of the one that's. must be wrong. Expectations of me. Doing this for failure. For God's sake. Care. Oh, come on, just destroy some of the other ones so I can get a better idea what the fuck to do. Oh, it destroyed that one with the whole um, whatever it was. <clears throat> I think it was the like, yeah, guy you forget everyone's not perfectionist. I'm gifted. Uh, I was never truly gifted or anything like the other kids. Uh, my parents didn't seem to care. My parents hired a pianist. Nothing but the best. And K. 
kid children to tease because of my hands. No, nowhere. Pissing out. Just a sort of hint button I could use to pissing say, yo, help me out. Very high expectations of me. Don't enjoy this fear of failure. Some fresh and allowing to become a celebrated pianist. No, of course not. Of course not. Some kind of bloody system to this. God's sake. Come on. Very high expectations of me. Um, and I'm going to become a celebrated pianist. Oh, for fuck's sake! I wasn't even using that one! Oh, never mind. Fuck me. Uh, I must be getting somewhere then. High expectations of me. And we're taught a painful lesson. It was taught me to fear failure. Oops. Yeah, you always taught me to fear failure. Crying out loud. I'm pointing at that one, number four. Uh, constant perfection allowed me to blah blah blah. Oh, there we go! That's the bloody solution. Fucking hell. Sometimes this game goes suck a dick. <laughs> but now we've completed two patients. Well. Here we are. 
there is more to this fading old gal than I thought. That performance where I, um, forgot where I was, it wasn't about the Alzheimer's. It wasn't even about being perfect or about me as a performer. Hmm. It was about fear. Perhaps my whole life's work has been about fear. Fear of failure, fear of Mr. Oh. My piano instructor as a child berating me over and over and then slamming the fallboard on my hands. Ouch. Even after he had long since left my life, I still felt something in the pit of my stomach every time I reach for the keys. Curious how I forgot that moment, and yet its ghost continued to haunt me, pushing me, chasing me really to the greatest heights, taking its toll on my spirit with every step, every perfect performance. I wonder if the ghost too will fade along with everything else. Perhaps the Alzheimer's will provide that one final mercy. But even if it doesn't, I feel a sense of rest now. That's possible. Refreshed, like when you air out a dusty room. <laughs> I suppose healing will take time. I don't know how much of that I have left. The song of my life may be reaching its conclusion, but I now feel certain of this. It will be ending on a high note. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Doctor. Thank you for this most precious gift. Oh, that's amazing. That's really amazing, that is.